Ian Johnson here in the Truck Hero booth at SEMA 2021. I'm with Jason from Rugged Ridge. And there's no question, Gladiators are super popular. A lot of them out there. And we're gonna talk about this bad boy right here. This is called the Sport Rack, right? Sport Rack, yep. So this is uh, basically goes in the back of the Jeep. Yep. And it, gives us a bunch of mounting points. It does, it provides that kind of old school look, but it's got the functionality because it comes in with these crossbars so you can mount anything, you know, and still have room in your tailgate. Yeah, so you can put like kayaks or bikes or whatever you need in the back. That's right. And then it's got this cool kind of look that kicks up over the top, light bar at the top. That's right, it's a slotted uh, section up there where you can put any light bar you want, universal light bar. Yeah, so any number of lights, position them how you want. Yep. And then I kind of dig it because you said it mounts basically using factory locations, right? Yeah, so this is the trail rail uh, cargo system. So it mounts directly onto that. Now, if your Gladiator does not have this cargo system, we include a rail that will mount on this. So you don't have to drill anything into your bed. Yeah, so no cut, no drill, nope. bolts in. Bolts right It's got in. a cool look. And, and, and kind of like the Sherpa rack on the JL, it sits a little proud of the body. So it's almost like a little rub little, rail on the side of this bed. protection. Yeah, yep. which is super cool because, you know, tied in with the tube fenders and you don't really have to worry about this bedside too much. That's right. Because exactly. I bought one of these beds, they're not cheap. <laughs> no, they're not. And now you said the crossbars, we don't have them in here because I dig this. This looks cool because it's got that pre-runner look. Yep. And this is... It's a tire carrier and it bolts right, right on directly to the back of your, uh, your bulkhead. No drill. Yep. Bolts uses the OE holes and it holds up to a 39 inch tire. So 39 inch tire, uh, basically mounts on using lug nuts. And no, so you put this combo together. I kind of like it. It's kind of like that pre-runner look with us two combos together. Absolutely. I dig it. And you could still run one crossbar back here. Yep. If you had just wanted to carry something just back here. Now, I also noticed that the tire is not resting on the bottom of the bed, right? There's some space underneath There's it. There's a gap to, so you can put some plywood, you can put some small stuff right underneath it. You can still, so you can still use the still bed use as the a bed. bed. And to get the space for the different size tire, it basically moves up and down, right? That's right, it's adjustable for the size of your tire. And you have to have, well, not have to, if you're actually gonna carry a spare, because we're not fitting anything above a 35 underneath the floor of the glider. That's You're maxed out down there, yeah. so you gotta put it somewhere. Yeah, so it's either throw it in the bed and let it bounce around, or get one of these mounts. Mount it securely. What, what, that's what I would do. So there you exactly. go. Whole bunch of accessories for your Gladiator, and if you need to know more about them, where are we going? RuggedRidge.com.